All right, guys, I just wanted to make a quick little update slash rant video about what's going on with my current situation and then what's happened in the past 24 hours since finding out. If you if you haven't seen the video already, I'll link to it oh, over there. Um, basically, I got banned from streaming for 90 days. Um, so I thought I, there might be a chance a slim chance that I could appeal it but uh, after conversating with uh, YouTube on Twitter basically I have three options if it was an accident I can appeal it in a, in a separate area it wasn't an accident though like on an accident on YouTube's part um, I can contact the copyright owner and ask them to remove the copyright strike or I can wait the 90 days so uh, I'm going to email the copyright owner is DreamWorks Studios, which is a part of NBC Universal. So DreamWorks didn't have an email or anything on their website, but NBC Universal did. So I'm going to email NBC Universal after I make this video, and uh, hopefully they'll hear my plea and agree to remove the copyright strike, and all will be well in the world. But I have I don't have much faith in that. I mean. They're a big corporation, and typically big corporations don't care about little guys like me and little issues like this. So I don't expect to hear back from them, but it would be really cool if I did, and it would be really cool if they removed the copyright strike. Um, so, yeah, with that being said, though, I just wrapped up my first uh, non-YouTube stream. I streamed on Facebook. Uh, a buddy of mine had been talking to me about it for a while now just to try it out. He says he watches people on Facebook sometimes. And, you know, it doesn't matter, like, who you are. Most videos seem to do pretty well. So I thought um, he, he had texted me again today. and was like, yo, now that you're banned, try out Facebook. So um, while I get everything on Twitch set up still, I, I still got to make some graphics and stuff. I'm going to be streaming on Facebook um, just a couple more days. Today is Monday, so I'll stream tomorrow, Tuesday, uh, and then uh, on Wednesday. Well, I guess... You're, you'll be watching this on Tuesday. So I will stream today on Tuesday and tomorrow, Wednesday, on Facebook. I'll have a link down to my Facebook below. Um, and then on Thursday, that is the start of uh, Season 7 for Fortnite. So I want to try and do that on Twitch. So Thursday is the launch day for Twitch. And I'll link to my Twitch down below too. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitch. Um, so yeah, Facebook, today, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and then starting on Twitch, we'll start Thursday. I typically don't stream on Thursdays, but it, since it is the start of season seven, um, I really want to stream. Uh, so I, I'm thinking I might take like the day off from work or maybe even just a half day so I can get, get home a little earlier and stream before I have to go to uh, you know band practice and whatever. So yeah, just be here for that. Uh, and if you guys, like I said too, come watch me on Facebook. I know Facebook is a little weird and it's a little personal. Uh, so if you guys don't feel comfortable or you don't have a Facebook, I know a lot of like the younger generation doesn't have Facebook. So um, that's cool too. I'm only going to be doing it for two more days. So um, yeah. But also on that note, thank you guys so much. Um, those of you that did come from YouTube over to Facebook, it, I, I feel like the Facebook stream did, did really well. Uh, it did better than I anticipated. Um, and I did see some familiar faces, so it was really good to see you guys. I appreciate the continual support and this very trying time for me. I'm still devastated. My heart still hurts, but today's Facebook stream gives me hope that this isn't the end of my streaming, you know, hopefully that we can just roll with the, with the punches and, and move on into, into Twitch. Um, and you know, hopefully NBC hits me back and says they'll remove the strike or, you know, we have to wait the 90 days. Who knows? Uh, lots could happen in 90 days too, you know? We could get on Twitch, hit affiliate really quick, um, and then get partnered. And if we get partnered on Twitch, or if we get an offer to be partnered on Twitch, I might take it. I don't know. Um, it just depends. Um, or, you know, Twitch could tank and you know, all my momentum could die and then I'll come back to a dead YouTube channel. Or in the 90 days, I could decide that maybe streaming's not for me anymore and just quit. I won't do that. 
I love streaming. I've already told you guys I love it. Lots can happen in 90 days. Right? If you asked me 90 days ago if I thought I'd be getting a 90-day ban, I would have told you you're stupid. That would never happen. But here we are, you know? So, yeah, who knows? I don't know if Twitch will be my, my permanent home in the future. Um, I don't know, you know, I don't know if I'll stay on YouTube. Who knows? Um, I would like to stay on YouTube. I really... As, as crappy as their algorithm is, um, I like YouTube for different reasons. So really quickly, I'll explain. Like the algorithm, from what I can understand, is based off of viewership time, right? So the more time a video is viewed, the more likely it is to get recommended, okay? So uh, that's why you typically see like the big YouTubers, their videos are only like 10 to 20 minutes long because... That's about as much attention span as most people have, like 10 to 20 minutes, and then they're like ready to move on to something else. So 10 to 20 minutes, if they get people to watch all 10 to 20 minutes of that video, they know it's gonna get pushed even higher. So like bigger channels on YouTube get bigger because their videos get watched and then they get recommended and then more people find them. Smaller channels stay small, it's really hard. So as much as that algorithm sucks, um, I like YouTube because when I'm at work, I can't watch Twitch. Twitch is blocked at, at my work. And I know it's blocked for a lot of people at work because it's considered like a gaming website. Um, so YouTube YouTube isn't. YouTube has educational videos and news videos and all sorts of stuff. So most places don't block YouTube. And my goal is that one day this becomes a full-time job and I wanna be able to stream during the day for people who are at work, you know? Because I, I love, like, it gives me something to do. I love watching YouTube at work. It gives me something to do. Otherwise, I just sit at a desk all day and stare at the walls. But if I have somebody to watch, it makes the day go by so much faster. And that's a big reason I try and stay family friendly, too. Like, I don't like when I'm watching somebody and they scream, like, the F word or whatever. Because, you know, who knows who's walking by my desk, who can hear it. I don't, I don't want that, right? So I like to watch family-friendly people at work. And so that's one of the main reasons I want to, I, I want my channel to be family-friendly. It's because I want people, working-class people, you know, who are watching at work to feel comfortable and to feel safe watching my videos, watching my streams at work. Um, that's a big deal for me, and I want to, I wanna, like, kind of pay it forward um, if this ever becomes a career for me. So uh, that's why I want to stay on, on, on YouTube. Even though the algorithm sucks, even though I feel like a 90-day ban is a little harsh for anybody's first offense, I, I, I like YouTube. Uh, it's easy. Uh, it's cool. I met a really, lot of really cool people on YouTube. Twitch, From I've, I've been talking to some other streamers, some other small streamers that have tried to switch to Twitch or, or did, and now they're back on YouTube. And a lot of them said it's really, really hard to get noticed on Twitch. So there's like a plus side and a downside to both platforms, right? The plus side on YouTube is little old me gained 500 subs in like six months. That's really cool. That's really good growth, but it's kind of hard to get monetized, you know? Like we're still grinding that monetization. Um, Twitch, from what I've been told, it's fairly easy to get, to be able to like, quote unquote, monetize your channel. They call it something different, but it's hard to get noticed on Twitch. So, um yeah, who knows? I know I said that a hundred times already, but who knows? Who knows what the future holds? Who knows where that's going to lead? Let me circle back, though, and um, talk about streaming again. Okay, so I will stream on Facebook today, Tuesday, tomorrow, Wednesday, and then we're launching on Twitch Thursday for Season 7 of Fortnite, which reminds me. All right. Don't tell anybody, okay? This is between you and me. But if you've made it this far into the video right now, what I want you to do, leave a like on this video and go down to the comments and type the words mashed potatoes. And that's it. Don't say anything. Don't tell anyone. This is our secret. If you leave a like on this video and comment the words mashed potatoes, you will be entered to win a season seven battle pass for Fortnite. Okay? Don't tell anybody. Don't ruin it. I want to support the people that are loyal to me and watch my videos all the way through. Okay? 
So this will be our secret. Comment mashed potatoes, leave a like, and you'll be entered to win. We'll give it away probably Thursday or Friday. Um, season 7 Battle Pass. All right. So uh, I will keep you guys posted on what happens, what, um, you know, if I hear back from NBC Universal or not. I don't anticipate to hear back, like, overnight. I typically, like, I would say, like, 30 days. Um, so hopefully they respond. Uh, hopefully it's in a timely manner, and hopefully um, they agree to remove the copyright strike because, you know, that would be super awesome. I'll keep you guys posted, and we'll go from there. So thank you all for the continual support. I hope to see you either on a Facebook stream or when we launch on Twitch. And I'm going to try and do, you know, YouTube as well. I'm going to try and do uploads uh, as many as I have time for in a week. So hopefully you guys stick around on YouTube. Hopefully this all works out. And my brand, the Sad Ghost Squad, Sad Ghost Club, whatever you want to call it, the Sad Ghost brand continues to grow. And yeah. So, I'll see you guys all later. Look at, look at like breeze. Ooh, yeah, yeah,